How's it going, everybody? It's the man, the man, the legend, Quad MFT here, bringing you Father Sunday, which of course is a dual commentary with my dad. Introduce yourself. Hey, what is up, warriors? Today we have three topics. We have the perfect answer for school bullying. All right. And uh, a guy who was suspended for a tweet. That sounds pretty crazy. Sounds like something I would get in trouble for, but go on. Yeah, and, and uh, of course, killer pets. Killer pets. Okay, that sounds regular, like a regular thing. Yeah, well, you know, everyone's looking for answers for how to stop bullying. Yeah, yeah, of course. People, I mean, all these different celebrities are, I'm anti-bullying. I mean, you don't really hear too many people who are pro-bullying. Yes, like. I'm pro-bully. I got my signs. I'm going to be walking yeah, in front exactly. of school. Yeah, exactly. More bullying, more bullying. You never see that ever. <laughs> no, anyway. people are blaming video games. They're blaming movies. They're yeah, blaming the I mean, internet. No. I mean, They're looking for anything. Exactly. They're looking for anything they can blame on them, except they can't accept the, the actual their responsibility for it. Yeah, personal choice. Yeah. Well, a school in New Hampshire banned dodgeball. Because okay. they said that it increased the opportunity for bullies to take advantage of those who are weaker. I could see that, but like, well, why get rid of the whole sport? Like, that's just kind of like it's just it's just dumb. It's just again looking for another excuse. Like, yeah, and it, they they said, oh well, it's a human target game, so let's get rid of all human target games. Human target games. Life is human target. Yeah, well, I mean, what's next? Like tag. Yeah, exactly. No you tag. tag me too hard. No yeah. tag. And like, obviously, people are going to team up against other people no matter what. Yeah, and and you know what? Last time I checked, if you want to play dodgeball, it's optional. Yeah, exactly. You don't have to play dodgeball. Maybe you can go and sit in the corner and do cartwheels. I don't know. <laughs> you can play or not play. Yeah, exactly. You know, the way I figure it, as long as there are kids in school, there's always going to be bullies. Always, no matter what. I mean, you, you can't prevent it. But but maybe the solution is there shouldn't be kids in school. Kids in school, that's what I want. I'm all for it. I'm fully supporting no school. Let's do it. That's right. That will get, of all, get rid of all school bullying. I promise you that. <laughs> yeah, but you know what? There's another guy who got suspended for tweeting in school. In school, like during school or something? Or? Well, I don't know exactly when, when he tweeted it, but basically mm -hmm. what happened is Kyron Burdeen, okay. a junior in Arlington High School in Texas, yeah. he got he took a picture of his star testing. Okay, yeah, we have star testing in California. Yeah, he took a picture of it because he said basically what he wrote on there was, well, you'll see the picture right here, but mm -hmm. he said, uh, you know, I'm too busy for this stuff. I don't get graded on it. YOLO. Exactly. <laughs> That sounds like something I would do, except I wouldn't. I, I'd think it, but I probably wouldn't do it and put it out to the extent that he did. But that sounds like, I mean, I see star tests. They aren't graded. I'm, I'm not sh really sure what star, star test t stands for. Tell me down in the comment section below. But really, guys, I kind of agree with it, but I don't get why he got suspended for well, it. That's he, like way over the limit. He just didn't tweet it. He tweeted it at the school board and at the board of education. <laughs> So that wasn't the smartest movie could have made. No, it wasn't. But you know what it was? They didn't. They didn't actually. He ended up getting suspended for four days. Four school. whole. I, I'll take four days off of school. Yeah, I was gonna say it's kind of a bonus, huh? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> no, but and the reason the reason he did it was because it was quote a breach of security of the test, even though it was only the answer sheet and it didn't have any of the questions on it. Oh, that that's just lame. That. Yeah. Uh, you know, if they're looking for a way to get you. That's that's one way to get you, though. But I think what he was doing, he was looking for more followers. Cause I think he got followers. Out oh, I would do it. I would do it. I mean, <laughs> gosh. But, I mean, it wasn't exactly original. YOLO. Yeah, it, I know, but it's still a pretty cool idea. I wonder if I wonder if the adults knew what YOLO stood for. Maybe a few. Maybe they were informed right then. Or maybe, like, the people who grade the star tests or whatever. I don't know if they're machines or, or whatnot. But, like, what would the machine register it as? Or what would the parents think, like... What does YOLO mean? I mean, yeah, like, I don't know. I was thinking he he got famous for that. We should make up our own. Like I was thinking, like you know, you play one in the chamber. Mm -hmm. It should be YOSO. You okay. only shoot once. <laughs> yeah, you only shoot once. All right. Yeah. Or, or maybe YOPO. You yep. only play once. You only play once. I play multiple times with and then, myself, but no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hold on. Um, and then and then what, how about YOVO? You only vote once. All right. Yeah. yeah these I, these I could catch that. on. They're they're on fire, don't you? Maybe think? one day. I mean, YOVO. I, I'm rocking it. Yeah. All right. How about YOYO? -Yo? You're on, you're only young once. Okay, yeah, I mean, you're young like 27 years in a row or whatever, but that's once, I guess. <laughs> and then the last one, you guys might have to go to the, the dictionary.com to look up this one. This is YOMO. You only masticate once. Okay, that sounds really inappropriate. Yeah, no, no, mastication is, is fine. I do it all the time. What is mastication? Go, go in depth you, for us here. You guys, you know, you guys got to look at it. Okay, it's chewing, okay. but it's, <laughs> it sounds dirty, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, exactly. Okay, so I think people in the comments below should make up their own yo whatever. Yeah, tell us like YOVO, YOJO. I don't even know what, what other yos we could come up with, but tell us down in the comments section below yoga hey okay. all right so what about what about this i i have to say son i gotta confess i have bieber fever bieber fever okay that's really weird yeah every time i hear of justin bieber i kind of get sick <laughs> is that what <laughs> it is I think bieber... no good, he's yeah. in the news again and it, it... he's always in the news he's the most famous person in the world right now he he was buying a monkey i, I, think... would, I don't want a monkey you I, I think in germany but he it got quarantined 
quarantine. So like stuck. Like I know there's a movie yeah. called Quarantine. Or yeah, whatever, but. He, for like seven days he wasn't able to. Still isn't, as far as I know, pick up his uh, monkey and bring it in the United States because he didn't have the proper paperwork. Well, I, I, that, that would be the first thing I would do is get the paperwork filled out. Yeah, you'd think. You'd think, but but it's gonna cost him like eighteen eighteen thousand dollars. That's I, like nothing to him though. He's like nineteen. He's where's he gonna get that kind of money? <laughs> The <laughs> kids don't have that kind of money these days. That'd geez. be funny. Yeah, but you're beating. Yeah, he actually has a, lot, a ton of money. A ton, stacks and stacks of cash. He got money to burn. Exactly. So, so anyway, uh, so so all right. Michael Jackson. He was known for having a monkey. Bieber That's now weird. has a monkey. Everybody. I mean, maybe all the famous people who are guys that kind of sound like girls. I mean, Bieber doesn't really sound like girls anymore. <laughs> but I mean, maybe they just like monkeys or something. I don't know what's up with that. Well, but. Mike Tyson. He had a lion. I want. No, I don't want a lion. That, that would be a horrible mistake. Yeah. Why? Why is it that, that people who have too much money on their hands always want to get deadly? pets like exotic animals like what's the point of having a freaking albino pet like polar bear or something like that yeah like, ultimately i'm sorry these animals these wild animals the lion the monkey they're, they're meant to be wild <laughs> yeah they're gonna rip your face off exactly eventually. like wasn't there that lady who got her face ripped off by like an ape or a, oh, an yeah. orangutan or something like that yeah there's a nine 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 one call yeah that, that you could hear where she's actually the monkeys attacking her and biting off her face Ugh, this was ew, her pet ew, ew. she used to sleep with it Wow, I, I don't want to yeah. sleep with a monkey. I mean, I, I don't trust my dog, really, completely, exactly, 100%, yeah. or my cat, so I kind of sleep with one eye open. But, you know, <laughs> if, you, if you bring a deadly predator into your home. Like we do. I mean, we have two dogs and one cat. cat. Yeah, two dogs yeah. and a cat. And a brother. <laughs> yeah, same thing. So. A pet. so, but but I never had any exotic pets. What do you think some some really cool pets that you'd want? I'd want a polar bear. I mean, those things are huge. They're like keep them in the tall. freezer. Yeah, exactly, keep them in the freezer, <laughs> along with your penguin. Exactly. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to give me a huge thumbs up down below. If we could try and hit 150 likes on this video, that would be absolutely insane. Subscribe to my channel if you guys haven't already. Make sure to follow me on Twitter and Instagram down in the description below. Also, go make sure to like my Facebook page. It's been Quantum FT, and I'll see you next time. See if I don't die, Yomo.